I'd like to share with folks this fun little solar project I've been playing with for months. It has several variations. The main concept is a plastic dish I dumpster dived many years ago, very rigid plexiglass dish. And several months ago I finally got around to spraying the inside with some industrial adhesive I had and put in some aluminum foil that I'd gotten at Dollar Tree. And it's, it's turned out to be a lot of fun. This configuration I'm playing with today uh, I'm making a new batch of kombucha tea and rather than heat the tea and sugar solution on my stove and use electricity, I thought I'd set it out here. Uh, the concept is a very, let me back up, a very important concept is whatever I heat in here needs to be raised. Uh, and I'm using, if you can see here, a small glass lampshade uh, that I've dumpster dived years ago. It's very, very rigid glass and it gives me the exact distance I need for things I'm cooking in here to be the right focal point. If I put this uh, steel pot on the exact bottom, it would not get very hot at all. Uh, so let's take a peek inside, see how things are going. There's the tea bags. Let's see how hot this thing is. And I can barely touch it. Another, actually, main reason I use this dish is my showers. Very simple. I get Arizona green tea jugs uh, from recycle bins. Spray paint them black. I always have black paint in the house for different art projects. Spray them black. And each morning I put the uh, silver dish in this lawn chair because the, uh, the curvature of the back allows me to shift the angle of the dish in many, many different degrees. Uh, and I just go in there, uh, stick the pot of water right there in the middle of the dish where the kombucha teapot is now. In about 20 minutes, I frequently have shower water too hot to shower with, and I actually have to take it out of the dish and let it cool. Uh, since I'm obsessed with water conservation, and that's putting it mildly, I take my showers in this plastic dish I dumped dive. I'm not too sure what it was supposed to be, uh, and I've lost my privacy somewhat to the freeze because the cassava got fried, uh, so I have to be cautious until everything regrows. But I stand in here, and I found if I lather up my head first, I can have a very comfortable solar shower with just one gallon of water. And to the point now, I actually sometimes have a some of that gallon left over. By standing in this tray, I can capture this water, and I dump it either on my roses <coughs> or lately on these sunflowers. I'm having fun growing uh, to try to get some co giant color out here. There's my charming neighbor's dogs. Anyway, that's it. I just wanted to show you all how with next to no money, a few cents worth of adhesive and maybe 50 cents worth of foil, I can make kombu tea, I can cook rice, I can fry eggs in this configuration, and by substituting a, a black jug of water, I can take my daily solar showers. That's it. Have a good one, y'all. Bye-bye.